Some DeSoto Elementary students are using a familiar toy to help them with a big class project. New tonight, Jonathan Goaty shows us the building blocks helping them reach their goal. Give a group of kids a box of Legos, sit back, and watch their imagination take over. When I see a Lego, I think of maybe a medical device, wheelchair, an ambulance. For the past two and a half months, that's been the mission for Garmin employee and parent Greg January. He's been challenging these Prairie Ridge Elementary students in Shawnee to think out of the box, to use their minds to get a leg up on other kids with Legos. January, along with volunteers, spent countless hours before school Mentoring these kids not only in the art of Lego building, but also health sciences. These kids get to choose a topic or a project that they research and learn about, and they get, they get to build, and they do all the work themselves. Take, for instance, second grader Adam White. His team built an x-ray machine. The motor just turns an axle, which turns a small gear, which turns a large gear, which rolls, whichever made the programming is going. A doggy drives it. It looks like a tank, and, it, and it's a wheelchair. For Rose Albert, the best part of the project is working with her friends. Because if you're working alone, you can't figure anything out. And But if you're working with a team, you can figure a lot out. Who knows with these kids, they just might come up with the next big invention. Jonathan Goaty, NBC Action News. <laughs> Garmin Industry sponsors the program. Right now, 33 students are in the Lego League. But in January, they hope to expand it to 4th and 5th graders next year. From kids to adults, Legos are always cool. Oh, they are cool.